previously on Game of Thrones. All right, who dies first? Who wants to dance in the castle? Kill them now! No one more life. Here's one. Salve a tutti amici da Sabu Game Love e benvenuti nel nuovo video del Trono di Spade. Questa è la seconda parte del secondo episodio, come vedete precedentemente eh, c'è stata la prima parte uscita il 20 marzo e niente, siamo qui per continuare il nostro gameplay. Non vedo l'ora, continuiamo! Siamo qua alla barriera. Ci sarà Jon Snow! Credo, spero. Ascensori. Prima del tempo. Castle Black. So this is the seat of the night's watch. The wall. Always wanted to see it. But not like this. Recruits at the gate! Questi personaggi nuovi non li riconosco. Looks like it was built by giants, doesn't it? You're new, here to take the black. Because you got that look about you. I need to speak to the Lord Commander. We uh, don't have one right now. It's Frostfinger you want. He'll get you sorted out. Frostfinger is not in the world. That grizzled old prune over there says us new recruits are all dead men. But don't let him scare you. <laughs> That's just his way. Positivity. You seem nice. That's not so good round here. Che non mi fido. Usa le scale, non possiamo salire semplicemente, no qua. Duncan Tuttle, Castellan of House Forrester. My uncle wrote to the Night's Watch. He goes on for a bit, but then he asks us to make you a ranger. As if it's a knighthood. So you see, Tuttle. I know. So you see, Tuttle. I you see, Tuttle. I know all about you. Don't know me, Piaschi. Even if you are man enough to own up to it. So, you say so. I do. Now then, we'll 
start your training in the morning. For today, you need a cot and a cloak. Understood. Non vedo il motivo per cui avremmo dovuto. Sooner or later, the night's watch will be your death. When it comes, try to make it quick. Sì, vabbè, dicevo, non, non avrebbe avuto senso mentire perché. Tanto per un po' avremmo dovuto dire la verità. E aveva pure scritto, quindi. Cosa fai di medio? Is that him? Has to be, doesn't it? He's hideous. Had a run in with Walter Frey, did you? And he's leaning on a girl. Should have buried him with the corpses. Forrest is a real shame about your leg. Gives a toss. Don't let go of your sister now. Tanto vi ucciderò tutti. Lo sapete questo, no? farmi rispettare qua I wonder what's weaker your legs or this house move now ciao Così si porta rispetto. Let's go. Gatti. It's ridiculous. You're treating them like wine keeps their wits dull. It makes us look weak. Both of you, please. So you'd rather they riot? Duncan, you're a damn fool sometimes. It doesn't matter what you think. I was chosen as sentinel. My lords. Look. Perhaps we should get started. Yes. yes. Let's. Dahlia's told me the state of our house. And you know our situation is grim, my lord. No thanks to your sentinel. He's been getting the White Hill soldiers drunk. It keeps them off their guard. They think you're a bloody fool. My lord, please. Oh, oh I'm a fool. At least I was there by your concern when Ramsay stole I've told you. I was keeping an eye on the Bolton soldiers. You 
should have been protecting your lord. Now Ethan's dead, and Ryan a hostage, and one of you doesn't get him back. Nothing. Did she do it? I am your lord. Of course. Apologies, my lord. The Whitehills have my brother. We fight amongst ourselves, and we should be fighting them. We need an army to win that fight. And we don't have one. Not anymore. Then find me one, Sir Roy. That's no simple command, my lord. Most of our men fled after Lord Ethan was killed. And our allies are either dead or too afraid of the Boltons to help us. You forget the Glenmores. Okay. You'd be wed to Elena Glenmore already, if not for the war. And her father is no coward. Now that you've returned, the marriage can proceed as planned. The marriage? Well, much has changed. The Glenmores may no longer desire the union. Lady Elena will decide for herself. Your betrothed is on her way here as we speak. Lady Elena? She's coming now! Mm, He's barely recovered. I'm not ready. My son, I understand your doubts, but if she still wishes to marry, we'd have the allies we so desperately need. Their army would become oath-bound to Roderick. And we could burn High Point to the fucking ground! Yes, this marriage could be our chance. Of course, we must hope Lady Elena still wants to marry Roderick. Talking about a marriage, not an ironwood contract. Never been sure. I'm certain I can convince her. She's always been fond of you. Just be careful not to push Elena too hard. If Elena does come to Ironrath, she'll see those soldiers in the courtyard. We starve them out, and they'll have to leave. I'd rather they be lying around drunk than setting their stables on fire. My lord, perhaps you could put an end to this tiresome dispute. Mm. Keep them drunk. Yes, my lord. No, there's nothing more to discuss. Ma li verrebbero gli altri soldati poi. It's time to light the ironwood torches. Yes, my lady. Che c'ho come il signor di anelli. It's got to be back. Gregor last lit these torches when his mother passed. Ironwood doesn't burn easily, he told me. But foresters have a way. And now we light them for him. And Ethan. How is your song coming? Ethan always helps me with music. It's not the same without him. You're a fine musician, Talia. You do a great job. Everyone knows how much Ethan meant to you. I'm sure it will honor him well. About Elena, I've sent a letter to Mira. The Tyrells hold much influence over the Glenmores. I don't know where things stand between her and Lady Marjorie, but maybe your sister can find a way to help. Gatti che vogliono salire, no. It's entirely ridiculous. If it's not the flowers, it's the food or the table settings. Is that the letter to the orphanage? Yes, my lady. It's nearly done. Make sure to tell them we'll send all the leftovers. And mm, something nice after that. Mm. We will make a sizable donation in the name of King Joffrey. A little presumptuous of you, Mira, but I like it. Oh. They'll be very grateful. Meno male, ho paura, fatto un casino. And the seal. Here you are. Fatto bene a non rubarlo. Fatto benissimo. Any more invitations to send, or are we finally done with the cursed things? One more. An invitation to Sir Maynard. 
Yeah. Ah, yes. One of my father's favorite drinking companions. I have a letter for Lady Mira Forrester. Thank you. My pleasure, Lady Mira. What is it, Mira? It's from my mother. She asked that I help ensure Roderick's betrothal to Elena Glenn will remain intact. How can you do that from a thousand leagues away? Ah, it's my help she's after, isn't it? She's a bold woman. Most would shy away from asking such things. Forgive my mother. She doesn't see the harm in what she does. She's not entirely wrong. A letter from me could encourage the Glenmores to honor the betrothal. But it wouldn't be very discreet you'd be forcing their hand. Mm. That isn't the way I do things. You pushed me before, and you saw the results. I'm sure your brother can secure the marriage on his own. I'd better get going. Mira, we'll talk more later. Oh my god. Che cosa faccio? Oh my god. Bisogna essere audaci. Marjorie sent me to pick up the letters. Elena of House Glenmore. I've never heard of the Glenmores. I know you're very busy with Lady Marjorie and... and all that's happening with your family. But I was hoping we could talk. If you don't mind. What about? Well, it's... We really should get these letters sent first. Do you need any help with them? I've got them. Mr. Bill, see you later, so I can photo casino. Cos'è Sheldon? Non che usiamo problemi su lui. Get along fine. Most of you will be dead within the year. Frostfinger and his bloody speeches. If you want to survive in the night's watch, listen close. You know why I got sent to the war? The war was erected over 8,000 years ago. You'll get us in trouble. Don't be such a bootlicker. That this girl I used to fuck now and again. Face like a queen, tits like a whore. Turned out she was married to some monkey. He tried to stick me with this. I was stuck in him instead. Shut sure, up for once, will you? What's your problem? I was sick of Finn bragging about all 
the girls he's fucked. What the diacrom are you here for? Fucking potatoes. Potatoes? You fuck potatoes. What? No! I stole them. That's what got me sent to the war. Nobody cares, thief. Don't call me that. My name's Cutter. Cutter the potato fucker. There's one for the songs. Oi, my sister was on. I've got something for your sister. Leave him be. Who in seven hells is talking back there? Sorry, sir. It was my fault. Covering for your new brothers already, are you? Garrett Tuttle here wants to be a ranger. So we can go north of the wall and die on some wildling spear. But what he wants doesn't mean shit. So today you're all gonna show me what you're made of. Can you swing a sword? Shoot a bow? Are you strong? Those who do well might just survive. The rest of you. Frostfinger. I could all. I need a word. Go on, get started. Best of luck, Tuttle. Here we go. Again. Who's up? Meglio avere come alleati dei confratelli che non un superiore, secondo me. I tell you to. Let's start easy. Middle dummy, center of the chest. You can follow orders at least. Next bolt. Left target, head. What is something wrong with your eyes? <laughs> Sono un buon acciaio. Finn thinks he's so bloody clever. If a real wildling got his hands on him, he's just a bully. Ah, he is. That's why I took this. Swiped it right off him. <laughs> Don't tell, all right. 
I don't think you take it kindly. So I won't do. tell anyone. I knew I could trust you. Dove uh, fidarmi del ladro o dell'assassino? Non dovrei fiarmi di nessuno in teoria, ma. No? Dove che ci sta? Ma qua è la cosa. Simpatico. Tu ho detto posso andare. Tanto al fuoco qua accanto. Io pensavo di farti amico E invece vai a fare in culo stronzo You're pathetic Fuck off You didn't even try A crossbow is a coward's weapon Besides I could hit that dummy from here with my Where is it? Where the fuck's my knife? If someone has it I'll cut their fucking balls off Maybe someone stole it. Who the fuck would have... It was you. What? You little fucking thief. It weren't me. Finn, don't. <gasps> Give me my knife. I don't have it, I swear. Out of my way. Got it. Do something. But stop it. Before some... Uh! And now, I won't say it again. Ma che grosso e scemo questo Oh, oh, oh. 
Prenditi Come prendi quel bastardo? Dove l'ho nascosto? You must have hid it. <laughs> And you, I expected better, Tuttle. Instead I find you doing this. On your first bloody day of training. Sir, I... Not another word. You clearly need a few days scrubbing the latrines. Frostfinger, I need another man to top the wall. Fine, let him freeze his balls off. I'll deal with this one. Get off! Mind your fucking manners. You, come with me. Ha detto bastardo. Ok, direi che per oggi può bastare. Allora ragazzi, questa è stata la, secondo, la seconda parte del secondo episodio del Trono di Spade, spero vi sia piaciuto. Mi raccomando, come sempre, se il video vi è piaciuto, mettete like, condividete il video, commentate qui sotto e iscrivetevi al canale e alla nostra pagina Facebook. Uh, vi ricordo che siamo qua, noi di Subo Game Love siamo qua, admin di questo project marketing che si chiama Second Live, che dà um, la possibilità ai canali emergenti di crescere, trovate tutti i link in descrizione qua sotto. Devo dire che comunque questo, questo secondo episodio mi sta piacendo. È cominciato, cioè il, primo, il secondo episodio è cominciato con il combattimento che è molto figo. Quando si parte con il combattimento è sempre bello. E poi si è passata prima la fase di studio. Credevo che questo secondo episodio fosse come il primo, cioè che c'era soltanto l'inizio di combattimenti e poi soltanto politiche. Invece vedo che uh, anche qua in mezzo riesce a esserci qualcosa di di più piccante, di più, di più, di più action, diciamo, mettiamola così. Comunque sia, ci vediamo al prossimo episodio che penso sia l'ultimo, sia l'ultimo del, del secondo episodio ovviamente, l'ultima parte, ma io sempre con questa cosa. Comunque sia, e ci vediamo alla prossima parte del secondo episodio, che credo sia anche l'ultima, un saluto da President Shirra e da Sobo Game Love. Ciao!